in this DIY episode and do a snorkel fix. G'day and welcome back to Every Road Adventures. I'm Nathan and this is a brand new series of a DIY maintenance. And I'm gonna run you through some of the maintenance that I do to my trusty Triton here. So if you're new here to Every Road Adventures, this channel is all about helping you discover and create your own adventure. Now let's get into it. In this DIY episode, I'm gonna do a snorkel fix. Now, the screws that mount this to the A-pillar here are just worn out, the holes have flogged out a bit, so we're gonna fix that with something really, with a really cool product. So we're gonna fix that one. And this is something that is pretty easy to do with a little bit of mechanical know-how. You don't need too much to do that. Now, this doesn't only happen to, I've got an Iron Man snorkel here. This doesn't only happen to Iron Man, I've seen it on Safari. So it's not so wholly and solely specific to the type of snorkel you run. Um, it's more of how it's mounted and it's this bracket. So I'm gonna grab the camera and I'm just gonna show you a bit closer how it's actually mounted. So I'm just going to share with you the things that we're going to need to do this job. So we're going to need some spanners, screwdriver because we've got to undo those old screws. Then with our holes we're going to have to drill our holes out a little bit. So we need a drill and a drill bit. And then this, a rib nut gun. We're going to put some of these in the holes that we drill, and that's all we're going to need. So you can see that we've ripped the bracket off, which is now exposed our old ratty holes. Now all we've got to do is drill them out and install our rev nuts. Right, so you can see we've now drilled our holes. So all we're going to do is grab our right size rev nuts. Um, and install them and then we can bolt it all back together so we're almost done got our rib nuts in so the plan is that this will they'll stick in there a lot better they'll hold in there and they'll be able to withstand pressure more than those screws because the rivets are rivet in held tight against the metal sandwich in the metal in there so these should hold tight whereas the screws could quite easily come loose um, I do know that these when they fitted are supposed to be supplied with some little rubber or uh, plastic grommets that screw in and spread open but they do pull out um, I didn't fit them when I fitted it the snorkel so I just fitted the screws but now I'm fitting these so let's hope now that once we put it all back together that it's as strong as we're expecting and it will do the job so 
let's go and grab the bracket and get it back on. nice and snug and it even looks so much better little DIY jobs like this one that I've done tonight they allow you to really keep on top of all the little things that may be starting to go wrong that there was not a big issue however by getting on top of it before it became an issue we we're able to you know nip it in the bud but there's so many other little things that we can do just to keep on top of the maintenance and keep our adventure rigs running great so on this series I will endeavor to just share some of the things that I'm doing to keep my uh, Triton in good shape now if you want to watch more videos like this then please subscribe to our channel and go and hit the like button and I'll see you in our next video